Hello Royal Spotlight, we are back again with episode 8 and today we have Andy who is the creator of Chalak. Hi Andy, how are you? I'm very well, how are you doing? I'm doing good. Now for those of you who don't know, Andy is from the UK. Um, so it's very late for him and very early for me, but we're going to make this work. I hope. What time is it for you right now? I mean, it's only 9.20 a.m., but <laughs> it's a Saturday morning. Very early for you. <laughs> it's yeah. early for me. <laughs> oh, it is early on a Saturday, that's fair. I know, I couldn't sleep in this morning either, so it worked out well. Um, I've still got another five hours ahead of me, so I'm good. You're good? Okay, five hour podcast. Mm. No, I'm kidding. We're not doing five <laughs> hours. Um, so Andy is the creator of Chalak, which is a bot that I use on my stream. Um, and recently Andy and Moth have joined together and you guys use the twitch.tv slash Chalak channel now for streaming. Is that correct? That is correct. Sorry, I've suddenly had sound start going off on my background. <laughs> Oh, this is lovely. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I suddenly had. I was like, "What the heck is that?" That's fine. Sorry. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um. And now, what? What? Okay, I need to ask because I'm really confused. What part does Moth okay. play in Chalak? He <laughs> is the person who. Uh, well, as as you know, I'm I'm not much of a people person per se. Like, Which is I've why got we get a along bit of great. If somebody, if somebody annoys me slightly, I'm just like, that annoys me! Where Moth is more diplomatic, so he is the face, let's say. And okay. I'm the person behind the scenes who... Does all the coding and all the creating thing. and all yeah. the clever stuff. Yes. Yeah. What, what brought you to the idea of making Chalak? It was originally because I was um, streaming. And I kept thinking, oh man, I really want people to issue challenges to me. I want them to say, oh, see if you can do this. And uh, and then on the stream, I'd see if I could do it. And then I thought, oh, I'd have to have some sort of prize or reward or something in place for that. So that's where we came up with the CAPS system. Oh, yeah. And yeah, that's just, it just sort of snowballed from there. And we're like, oh, now we've got the CAPS system. What else can we do? And then, yeah, so. It got bigger and bigger. That's. That's what we came up with the name, Chalak, which is challenge accepted. And yeah, so because your Discord, I always knew was challenge accepted, um, and this mm. was back in the day when your your bot was like very tiny. Um, mm. Actually, I didn't think I even knew about your bot at the very start. I just knew challenge accepted, and you guys would challenge each other, which was pretty cool. Yeah. And you guys would also play um, games together and have challenges against each other as well. So like yeah. a once once a month thing or a. I don't remember back then. I don't know. We we used to have that. Did you ever see the scoreboard system, where if we got yeah. a follow, if we got a sub, it would add points. Then the person who reached it would get a crown or something. I did see that. I miss those days. I miss those days. We actually had powers back then. Did you? <laughs> I I really want to bring back powers. It would be you type in freeze, yeah, and the whole screen would like ice over. That'd be really on cool. The the whole I know. I miss that like crazy. It was, it would just freeze. And the 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 rule was, if that ever happens, you're not allowed to touch your controls. Oh wow! So for example, if you're doing a racing game or something like that, and then it freezes, you have to stop moving, and you just see your car. So if you're, it was fun. We used could, to have. A could lot you of bring that back? Like that. Yes, and I really want to bring that back because that was that was a lot of fun. Would that so? Would that be like a person per stream? Like, say in your Chalak stream, if if Kim got the crown, she'd have it for your channel. But in my channel, if Hammy had the crown, or how would that work? Like the whole freezing um, thing. Probably, I'd now. have it like a really, I'd have it a really expensive command. Oh, like yeah, you fair do it, enough. and it will cost you ten thousand caps. So all your viewers could do it. Yeah. So it'd be like a channel point thing. Yeah, so okay. They'd do it, and it would cost ten thousand caps, and then the rule was you'd have to stop whatever you're doing. Yeah, right. And if you failed to do it, I don't know. Something, I'd figure something out. <laughs> something. Uh, for those of you who don't know, caps is the channel currency. Uh, the thing mm. that I really like about the caps is they accumulate over everyone's streams. So if you come to my stream and you earn caps on my stream, you have those caps when you go to Andy's stream or anyone else who's using the Chalak bot. Which I think is fantastic. It's really good. Um, why did you like think of integrating that for Andy? 
Um, well, it, like I said, originally we were doing the challenge, uh, the, like, it was me, Moth, we had a few others, and we're all sort of doing challenges with each other and competing against one another. And we just thought it'd be nice to have um, people can earn caps among all our channels. Mm. Because originally this was like a completely closed system. We weren't going to be sharing the code at all. This was just something which we thought, oh, that would be fun. That will make us stand out somewhat. Yeah. And um, so, yeah, I wanted a way that people could play games on my channel and then go over to Moth's channel, for example, and then continue to play games on there and continue to earn. And it just sort of made sense that we had some sort of networked economy, I suppose. I think it's really good. And I also like how you can only own caps if you're actually interacting with the stream. So you can't just look. Mm. That's what I like. Yeah, that really annoyed me because there was, you, you and I, we met through Royal Streamers, didn't we? Yes. And they had that whole system where you you sit in a channel and you lurk in a channel and you gain points that's how you earn yeah you gain points so the more channels you lurk in and i mean none of it was well very very little of it was genuine i only i only now still talk to you and one other person who i met through Brawl oh Stars. wow i don't think i talked to so. anyone except for you actually through royal streamers there we go oh it look at really that work, it? no it doesn't yeah, it was just a way to boost numbers right. yeah i i think it's cool royal though streamers is actually have you heard royal streamers has changed because they got like massively yeah. in trouble for like leaking data or selling your data or something like that they did get in huge trouble and there was like a huge post on on twitter about it and now they move over, over to like a website and yeah i think they've changed their name or something but yeah they're going like massive Matthew, yeah, I don't know what shit for that. Called anymore, but I have no idea either. Um, oh, so it wasn't really a system which I was interested in. No, it was pretty much just a system for me to like try and use and abuse, like everyone else, which gets you nowhere in the end. <laughs> so it's pointless. Um, what kind of things can we do with Chalak? Ah, there's a lot. Okay. Uh, well, there's yeah, there's yeah, the most recent count or the last time I counted, it's got over fifty commands. Oh, wow. So I was a bit like, ha. Huh. So I've actually stopped counting. And I know I've added at least a dozen since then. Yeah. Um, but yeah, based on, because it's the subscription model, isn't it? But um, there is a free version. The free version has the uh, the easy raid function where, because I used to, I, that, was, that was something I desperately wanted to add in, where I hated, if I ever wanted to end the stream, I'd have to like tab out, load up twitch figure out who's on yep. click on them see if they're and go uh, are you ra are you ending soon because you, you know have you ever done that we raid someone and they have just ended and yeah. you just sat on like a offline screen or you're raiding someone who's about to raid someone else and that sort of thing i had I it the other day i got raided the other day i'm like i'm about to end and i'm like god damn so i played for like another half now because i felt bad but yeah 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 i totally get it yep yeah that's so I wanted feeling. a system which sort of automated that. So the Easy Raid system is the one where you type in Easy Raid, it checks who's online, it will select five of those people, then it will contact them and say, would you like a raid? And the first yeah. one to say yes gets the gets the raid. And so. these are people who are using the bot. So contact people who yes. are using Chalak, who are online at that time. Yes, and that's including the free one. So even people who are using the free version get added to the Easy Raid list, but they have to have a thousand caps in yep. order to accept, accept it. it yeah so not just people sorry it's my phone not just people signing up and doing nothing with it so yeah um we also have the giveaway system do you ever use the giveaway system um i've used it twice uh purely because i forget about it and i very rarely do any giveaways <laughs> hmm. honestly did you see the most recent one the raffle the raffle is something which i'm quite interested in uh when no we... i haven't seen the raffle i've seen the giveaway the one where it like scrolls through all the names that's that's the giveaway system yeah okay, i've seen the raffle giveaway. one where it's no. like a, a circle that appears and all of the anybody who's spoken prior to the raffle being run mm. so if you were to do the the raffle at like let's say the two hour mark of the stream um everybody who's spoken prior to that moment will appear 
in this tumbler oh, type thing. Yeah. And it will spin around and all the icons, everybody's icons get jumbled up and shuffled around. And then it will stop on one person. So it's it's a completely free one. With the giveaway system, uh, they have to pay caps, like 100 caps in order to enter. But the raffle one is completely free. So I'm quite oh, that's excited pretty cool. for that. That's in the beta. So that will think... be coming out soon. I think I'm running the beta at the moment on my other overlay, on my main one. Oh. Yeah, I don't think I Look changed back to the main one. out for you. What? Beta one's usually the one where I'm experimenting with things, oh. so a lot of things break, but... At the moment, the games have been fine. I mean, <laughs> you, haven't, you haven't complained, so it's all good. <laughs> it's working okay at the moment. Oh, I might try that on our next stream. Hmm. Yeah, what's the, the what's the command for that? Just estimation mark raffle? Yep. Okay. Cool. There you go. Intuitive. Hmm. Easy as. Can uh, I do it now, actually? I don't know. If you're using beta, you should be able to. But if nobody has spoken in your Oh, stream, it's just me that's spoken. Anybody. Maybe I have yeah, to spell raffle right. To... Yeah, then probably not. Chalak's boat. Oh, well. Um, and now we have games as well for Chalak, which I love. Yeah, so I think we're currently sitting on about six games with three in development. Oh, okay. We've and... got Thank You, Drop It, Scribble Plus, um, races. Sheggle, which is everybody's favourite, The Races. Balls? Have you ever played Balls? Yeah, we found Balls by accident one night. What? So yeah. just typed in Balls. And yeah, it and then it popped up and it was like, woo, woo. Hello, 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 hello. <laughs> Where are they going? <laughs> what is this yeah. game? And then it goes, how many rats are in the bucket? And we're like, what? <laughs> and we're like, okay, let's watch it again. It's like, wee, wee, hello, 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 hello. And we're like, okay, trying to count. And they're like, how many blues? And we're like, fuck, we counted the red. <laughs> we're like, damn it. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. It was um, really fun. We yeah, total accident. And I'm like, should I message like Andy about this? Like, is this oh, a secret game? You should have messaged me about it. Yeah, there yeah. are secret games in there. Oh well, you really? You didn't know about the Chalasteroids one, did you? Cast. We well, were flying around that spaceship. Um, I knew about it, but I had no idea to get into it, and I really enjoyed that one. Yeah, there's also yeah. an entire RPG, like a three-hour-long RPG, hidden away in it as well. Yeah, I think you told me about that one. Um, and I think we had a look yeah, at it. Yeah, you're in really... it. Oh. I you am in it, there. yes. You're making mm. that roughly when, like, I was brand new to meeting you guys. You're making that. Mm. And I was like, what do you mean? You're like an RPG. I'm like, oh, okay, that's really cool. And I never, like, put you making the RPG in with, like, Chalak as a thing together. Uh, no, I, it originally wasn't. I just thought it'd be a nice little Easter egg to hide away. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, now, if you're on the free version, you only get hmm. one game per stream. Is that right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So out of the five that you have, you just choose one and you get that one game for that one time only? Yeah. Yeah. One and time only. As soon as you end it, you can't get another one. Yeah. And then until you... the next day. Yeah, until the next stream. And now you have the Patreon, which is where people can do the subscriptions to get different tiers within Chalak. Mm -hmm. What do the different tiers get you? you the <laughs> silver tier, um, which is the $5 tier, I believe, gets mm -hmm. you unlimited minigames. Okay. And people in your chat as they're speaking. In the free version, if somebody's speaking in your channel, they'd only earn like five caps a minute. But if uh, somebody is using the silver version, they'll be earning 10 caps a minute. Okay. by speaking in your channel but if they're a subscriber they'll be earning 20 caps a minute yeah, so it's right. to encourage people to actually subscribe to your channel so that they'll earn caps faster caps. so they can play more mini games they only have to speak for five minutes and they've got 100 caps oh wow that's so, pretty good yeah yeah and then so you got the silver tier what other tier do you have there's another one isn't there we've got the gold tier on top of that yep and the gold tier has the same as uh the silver tier where you get access to all the mini games but you also get access to the beta uh-huh uh which means you get access to the if we release a new game and we're not entirely happy with it even if it's perfectly stable we like to be safe uh, than sorry if that makes sense so it yeah. could be a month or two before we then shift that over to the silver tier so it's nice to have these 
new games and they also have access to the cap dungeon now i love the cap dungeon and my stream loves the cap dungeon what is the cap dungeon for everyone who doesn't know about it yet it's my favorite okay uh the cap dungeon is if anybody subscribes to your channel or donates caps to you the streamer it starts playing a little mini game at the top of the screen in which their icon their twitch icon or character will start moving along and will start fighting random enemies in a dungeon and at the very end of the dungeon will be a, a person using chalax so at the moment we have uh, me we have moth we have venema and we have you Yay, me. as one of the <laughs> bosses. And, well, I, I've been speaking to people about this recently. The best quote I've had regarding it is something that you said, which was in the last, sorry, in the last 20 minutes, because of the Cap Dungeon, I've had my entire year's worth of Chalak paid for oh wow yeah i can see how that works because people just love it so much they just like give bits and like sub and everything and that money can yeah. pay for chalak for the year and that was like 20 minutes and it's because of the cap dungeon people are like yeah. oh my god because they can fight each other in the cap dungeon it, they can retreat at any time and they can earn quite a lot of caps from it you had uh matt was on like crazy yeah, Man and Hammy, I might find it, I might put up there to demonstrate it, demonstrate it. Um, but yeah, once, because you can die in the cap dungeon, because the amount of yeah. caps that you, no, sorry, the amount of bits that you uh, donate depends on how strong your character is to go up against, like, the monsters yeah. in the cap dungeon. If you die, you drop your caps on the ground. And mm -hmm. if a new person comes in, they can pick up your caps if they defeat the yeah, and then they can type in retreat and yeah. leave, but other people can come in and stop them from doing it. And you, I've seen on yours, it's it's only <laughs> happened on mine once, but on yours I've seen it quite a few times where it's just gone absolutely crazy. But yeah, it's happened on mine once, but you've had people actually start fighting one another inside the cap dungeon on yep. numerous occasions. Yeah. Like, I think you messaged me once going, Andy! And I, was like, <laughs> yeah, and I came to your stream. And yeah, usually the process is about... I mean, somebody enters, and then they're usually dead within 30 seconds. Yeah. Right? Pretty and, much. And then the, the cap dungeon just fades away. But yours has stayed on screen for... A few like minutes. Two or three minutes, mm. which... They just keep coming in, just and coming in, and then and fighting the each other. Like... The, bo the boss is dead. Everybody's yeah. <laughs> just, like, trying to defeat each other at that point. So I'm like, just stop till we get they... to the next level. <laughs> when Yeah, when they defeat the boss everything resets it all gets harder and the amount of cap uh, yeah caps that they can earn from the cap dungeon increases so I'm how many caps to... is it per level how many what sorry how many caps per level can they earn because i didn't know uh, that the caps increase sure. per it's... level i had no idea about that mm, like i think it is literally a multiplier so okay. on on the first one everything is multiplied by one so the final boss is something like a thousand caps in his chest. Mm -hmm. And then in the second one, he's got 2,000, 3,000, 4,000. It just keeps going up the more, the higher yeah. the level that you actually get to. And at the start of every stream, do you go back to level one? Yes. I think I noticed So it all that. starts all over again. Yeah. That's pretty cool. There's not like a continuous, never-ending thing. I like that. Um... So apart from the cap dungeon and the games, you also have a store, which I still don't use yet. You also don't use that, no. <laughs> I yeah, still don't use the that. store. That's, that's not included in the free version. That's included in the silver and gold tiers. Yep. Where um, they, yeah, you can put anything in the store. Most people use it for selling or, or you know, um, I, I guess selling would be the word, but it's not an actual currency. Everything is bought using caps. So they speak yep. in your channel, they earn caps, and they can then, if they speak enough, I guess, they can spend those caps on whatever you put in the store. You can put in, I don't know, a, a, a signed postcard if you wanted to, or what I do is I've just filled the store full of video games. Video games, basically. yeah, Steam games. If I've got spare keys. 
So, Never thought yeah, of a postcard. That's a good idea, actually. I have like a whole lump of postcards to get rid of. I'm not kidding you. I literally have a whole lump of postcards. Are you ready? These are all my postcards. I was saving up for a postcard for ages. We'll keep saving. With my. I thought you stopped doing it. I thought you stopped because I was like. No, I still have it. It was like really expensive, like hundred thousand royal points well, or something. Well, because like that. I thought people would reach it really easily, so I made it expensive, but. You can get postcards on my stream if you're a sub for a year or if you buy them. Um, and you can buy them through either um, channel points or through mm. this like um, royalty points through the stream elements one. But maybe I will use the store. Thanks, Andy. I even have like Christmas ones. It'd be ones weird still. just having one item on your store, though. I will put other stuff on there too. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I will finally use the store. <laughs> I do like the store. I think it's a good idea. I just always forget about the store. Always. Um, there are also some interactive things that people can do. There's a mass celebrate. Mm. How much does that cost now? Has that changed in price? It's only 100 caps to actually do a mass celebrate, but you need to have 1,000 in order to trigger it. Yeah, there you go. It's a mass celebrate. What I didn't Thanks expect, though, is it's uh, in, in my channel or our channel. It's um, celebrate on its own. The single firework yep. has actually turned into... Because I imagined everybody like typing celebrate at the same time and it coming up with fireworks of all of these different people's logos and icons and stuff like that. And mm. I was like, oh, it's going to be brilliant. It's going to be beautiful. But no, it's it's now it now means sarcasm. If you fail, it just goes... Somebody types in fire, uh, celebrate and it just goes pop. And so it's now a sarcastic oh, thing no. in, in our stream. So it's, it's funny enough, just like <laughs> the worst celebrate ever. It just goes pop. Wow. Okay, if you guys are in my stream, do not do that. Okay, celebrate is still a happy thing, <laughs> not a sarcasm mm. thing. God, Andy, teaching my chat bad habits. <laughs> Sorry. That's all right. Um, there's a new thing that you've introduced recently. It is the... It's the stock market no we'll get to the stock market Ooh. it was the exclamation mark oh my goodness i've forgotten the command someone you in your chat bit, yep it. they can challenge you to do something and you can accept it and then people challenge can... oh okay yeah exclamation mark challenge yeah yeah that's all it is yeah. <laughs> what what's that one about what can people do with so that, that was that was going back to what we originally had but when we when we decided to share the code with everybody we thought we'd be a bit more restrictive and because uh Chalak is currently in its third iteration i've rebuilt the code from scratch and this is the third time i've done it yeah wow so um this third time i didn't actually have the celebrate uh sorry um challenge challenge feature in it at all and it was requested everybody was like asking for it so oh really i added it back in and um yeah so they type in exclamation mark challenge and then they say what they want you to do so mm -hmm. it could be something like um win the next game of call of duty or something like that and then it's up to the streamer to say yes or no uh, the viewer can also say something like um defeat this boss in five minutes and then Chalak will start a countdown from five minutes and then at the end it will if those five minutes uh, go off it will do an alert noise and it's up to the viewer to decide did they succeed did they fail yeah and people can actually bet on whether or not the streamer will win the challenge do people so get anything if, if they bet correct yeah they double their investment so they oh, bet wow. 100 gaps if they win they get 200 caps back yeah right that's cool um your channel is really like creative with stuff like that like i mean the people Thank in your you. chat are very creative thinking of challenges ah, for you guys excellent yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well, they've had a lot of <laughs> practice i guess yeah i think it's good i the thing i like about chalak like the bot itself is it is a very interactive bot and does get people to like mm chat in the channel um which brings me to what you mentioned before your stock market which confuses the hell out of me for whatever yeah, it reason it's a lot of people 
Yeah. So you have stocks and you can invest. Um, mm -hmm. Before we get into that, why did you want to bring in a stock market? Um, <clears throat> I wanted people to actually, everything I do with Chalak is to try to encourage people to actually speak more to mm -hmm. engage more with the streamer and it's not just me i'm not just thinking my channel needs more of this i'm like i need to see more engagement from these people yeah so because i noticed that people sort of started trying to trying to accrue things like oh i want to have five hundred thousand caps yeah and it's like, right why you're not going to have a, an opportunity to spend that many caps so we actually added in the cap drain system, mm -hmm. which would like obliterate everybody's caps at the end of the month. Yeah. And that upset some people. So we created the stock market. So there'd be a way that they could invest in a channel and it would, cause stocks are not destroyed at the end of the month. Usually, unless I detect that somebody's like, we've had people start hoarding stocks now. Stocks. Oh God. There was somebody with over a hundred stocks. We'll like, always find not, a way. <laughs> that's not the point. So yeah, they'll, they'll always try and find a way to break it or bend the rules or, you know, go against the grain. Yeah. But what I wanted them to do is have a way in which they can, if they invest in your channel, then they will want your channel to succeed. And the way to increase the stock value of the channel is to speak more yeah so they they when there's fewer people speaking in your channel which is usually round about the start like at the very beginning nobody there i want people to jump in as soon as possible buy up all the stocks and then talk loads in your channel get that stock value really really high and then sell and then they yeah. get a return on their investment because just like in real life you want to buy stuff when it's low and sell stuff when yeah. it's high yeah because mm -hmm. I see people in your chat, they're like, whoa, the stocks are like a thousand. We have to invest. And it's like, isn't that the wrong way around? Shouldn't you be selling your stocks now because it's a thousand? Like, that's, that's like confusing. That's me. what I mean. People <laughs> were, that, that's where people were trying to, um, they were using the stock market as a bank. Yeah. So they'd be like, oh man, I'll, I'll spend all my, because the, the more, if the stock's worth a hundred, then they'll have to invest 10 times in order to invest uh, a, a thousand worth of stock that oh, makes okay. sense yeah so right. if it's worth a thousand they only have to do it once so they're like oh i'm gonna and, and they were just using the stock market as a bank too so they could avoid the cap drain uh so and you've also changed it's it meant to be he... a mini game that people can play oh, i didn't really see it Sorry. as a mini game no good point like yeah. a permanently on mini game is yeah. the way i sort of saw it I was going to say that you've also changed it that you have to be interacting with the stream to be able to invest. Yeah, because we, again, with the lurkers, uh, we had people literally, I'm not joking here, I'm not joking. <laughs> they set a timer, a 10 minute timer on their phone. To come in and And they invest. would come back and they'd say invest and then they'd set the timer back again. And then they'd come back 10 minutes later and invest. But now you can only invest if you've engaged in the channel X yeah. number of times. Which is fair enough. And it's funny that you mentioned that because um, I know you and I had that conversation about the whole timer thing before. And the day before we had that conversation, someone in my chat was like, Princess, you need to add like a 10 minute timer for us. I'm like, no, just talk and do it yourself. So it's interesting to hear your side on that, that you've changed it so people can't do it that way. So yeah, somebody got quite uh, angry, seemed quite angry with me because we were talking about it in your channel and they kept yeah. saying things like, you're punishing people, you're put and I was like, I'm not punishing them. It's yeah, it showed you another side of what balanced. people, people look for though, but I understand where you're coming from. I mean, it sucks. Cap drain sucks. Especially for like people like Matt who gets like so many of them. He's like, oh no, now my caps are gone. And we're like, haha, sucks to be you. <laughs> that's why That's why you have the store. So they can yes. spend all their caps on the store. I know. I'll make that my Monday task. It's I don't stream. easy. I'm really busy now. That's fine. I understand. That's fine. 
I'm just I'm saying, also really it's, lazy. It's, I, I tried to streamline <laughs> it. I've tried to make it as easy as possible. But the admin screen is the least worked on system. I don't know if you've necessarily seen the admin screen. It's like I've tried to have Chalak relatively smart looking and functional and stuff. And then you do admin and it looks like a Windows 95 sort of We've been system through it before. suddenly pops up. We have gone through it once before, the admin screen. Um, yeah. Now, Cap Drain, no, not Cap Drain. Um, the stocks are on free version and paid for version? Not the free version. Oh, not the free version? No. Okay. So free version, get the games. You also have the death counter and a countdown mm -hmm. timer. Is that on free or paid? Yeah, that's on free. On free. Um, I use mm -hmm. the countdown timer all the time. All the time now. Excellent. I yes. use the death counter all the time because I suck at games. Oh, and we use the shot counter as well. Yes. Yeah. Oh, do you remember the card game? The card mini game? Oh, there? yes! I forgot about the card mini game. Tell us about the card yeah, game. we haven't used that. That's, uh, that was a cross-channel uh, mm. feature we had where um, you would all join a room. So you type in exclamation mark cards and you'd have to join a room or something like that. And um, when somebody in my channel summons a card by exclamation mark card, it would pull it up on my channel, your channel, anybody who's actually in the same room channel, and it would play a multiplayer drinking game, essentially saying, yeah. this person has to, so it come up with the rules on the card. And yeah, that was, that it was, was lots of fun. fun. I always forget about that. We should do that again one, one month hmm. because you have the drinking month at the end of the month, Moth and Andy have a drinking stream. Yes. Yes. And on the odd occasion, I think twice I've joined in on that drinking stream. And mm -hmm. they've been they've been quite fun. I mean, getting up at, you know, 6 a.m. Yeah. is not quite fun. <laughs> Wasn't it 5 a.m.? Didn't you get up at I, 5 a.m.? I think I got up at 5. Drunk? Yeah. I know, like, at the end of that, I'm going to see they're going, yeah, I'm here. Just a bit tired. <laughs> <laughs> they're still good, though. Do you still do them? The, the end of month? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The drink that's happening not this Saturday, next Saturday. So not this Saturday, it's... next Saturday. Oh, that's my Sunday. It's we, the we last have a meet up. Saturday of every month. You yeah. have a meet up? Yeah, we're having um a Royal Court meet up in Sydney. We're going bowling. Ooh. How many yeah. people are attending? Um nine or ten. Mm, nice. Yeah. Should be lots of fun actually. I haven't been bowling in ages. Are these people you've met before, or is it going to be the first time meeting them? Um, half I've met before, and the other half will be first time. That's cool. Yeah, most of them have been in my in my channel for like a while, quite a long time. But I'm not going to give any details out to anyone who may be watching this, because if I don't know you, you're not invited. <laughs> so that's all I'll we'll say about it. <laughs> so maybe next month, March, I'll, I can join you for a drinking stream. Sounds good. Yep. I think the last one you had you you had rug on it, I think. You guys were playing a game. Obviously. I think. Again, we don't tend to play games during the drinking streams. Hmm. Unless it's the like never have I ever or that type of thing. No, maybe it wasn't then. Maybe you just done drinking streams outside of your monthly drinking stream. Maybe. Did you see where I started getting allergic to the alcohol? Yes, I did see that. <laughs> you went like bright like red. Red eyes and it was like stinging and burning and I was like, ah. <laughs> it was crazy. Yeah. Have you drunken since that? Um, I think I did. I think I did a random one, which is what I'm thinking you're Maybe. connecting it to. Because I was playing a game and I was fed up with the game, so I started drinking and everything started burning again. I was like, what's going on? So you're actually allergic to alcohol now, do you think? I don't know. If I was, it's only happened in the last three months or so. Yeah, right. So that would really suck, but... That would really suck. I know quite a, peop like, quite a few people who are allergic to alcohol. It's becoming more popular. Just suddenly, suddenly becoming allergic to alcohol? Because um... I've been drinking for quite some time. I don't know if they've suddenly become allergic to it, but I definitely have one friend who's been allergic to it like for a while, and then we think my brother may be allergic to it. Um, oh. Yeah, but he doesn't drink enough for us to know if he is or not. Like, 
It's not like the whole red puffy face itchiness like yours. Um, and then I have another friend who now she thinks she's allergic to alcohol and that's a recent one. So I don't know. Maybe they've changed how they make alcohol these days. It sucks. I don't, well, it, the thing is, it was like the first half of the bottle I was fine with. Maybe <laughs> you're then... allergic to like a certain amount of alcohol. <laughs> you can only have 500 mils. After that, uh, you're allergic. <laughs> it was weird. It was very weird. Oh, that's horrible. Did um, you... Did you ever hear about the the merge system, the merge feature in Chalak? That was confusing. I posted I posted no. a change log about it, and I said, "This is really going to confuse people." No, Where, what's the merge? If you and I were streaming at the same time, yeah, um, I could actually connect my stream, my Chalak, to your stream. Okay. Which means if somebody donates on my channel, um, and they enter the cap dungeon. Somebody could then donate on your channel, mm -hmm. which would enter a joint cap dungeon, and they would start fighting each other. Oh, that's pretty cool. In there. Mm. Could you do something like that in your drinking streams? Like, if I came that's for a drinking... That's what we used to do. Ah. That's what we, that's what we did it for. And we had the... Because um, that was for the... You, do you remember the goal? where we i had to dress oh, up yes i remember your new year's eve drinking stream it was yeah, freaking that, that huge new year's eve, that new year's eve drinking stream was using the merge system so oh. depending on which channel you were looking at but since then we've actually properly merged and we now stream off of the you know that channel yeah now you both on chalak um with the chalak one i mm. think you and do you and moth stream together on the weekends on that channel yes well, permanently now yeah like all the time he's streaming on it right now and then i stream on it no i mean like you guys co-stream on it on the weekend mm -hmm. and then during the week you and moth have different days that you stream on it yes so what days is moth on it uh he's on it monday wednesday friday all right and then you're on it tuesday thursday mm -hmm. yep and then on the weekend you're together yep except for right now you're here with me that's because it's not the weekend for you. It's a Friday night. It's Don't worry. Friday. <laughs> <laughs> that explains it. I'm like, hmm, hang on. It's the weekend. Yep. Um, also with the bot, there was one more thing I was going to ask you about. What was it? Nope. I've completely forgotten what it was. No idea. Oh, well. But you do have a Discord for Chalak, like the bot mm -hmm. Chalak, not your private yeah. community one. Um, and people are able to join that when they log into the website or whenever. They can join it via the website. They can join it via Patreon as well. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah. Um, I'll put your Patreon link down the bottom and the Chalak website down the bottom <sighs> as well. Thank you. Yes. Now, how do people go about setting up Chalak in their stream if they want it? I actually have a video. I've created a tutorial oh, excellent. recently, and I don't know if I posted it. Did I post it anywhere? Um, I don't know anything really about it. That would be really useful for me to have posted. <laughs> yeah. No, would be. I don't think we did post it. I think I got so excited that I'd finished a video. I was like, "There, I'm done now." Yes, I did a video. Let's show no but one. Yeah, I... <laughs> no, I don't. I don't know where I posted it. Probably in the vid section. Uh, but yeah, it's from start to finish. It's actually about a, a thirty-second process. Yeah. Really? I mean, the the tutorial I set up was about five minutes because I'm carefully explaining what people need to do and why they need to do it. But realistically, you just type in your name and you're done. Yeah. Cool. And is there so... still a spot to recommend people? Like. Um... Yes. Yeah. And what does? Mm -hmm that go towards if somebody um so say for example somebody was to join chalak and they say that princess referred me then mm -hmm. once they hit the same tier that you've so if uh you're on the gold tier yeah so if their patreon um subscription or pledge i suppose matches yours 
-hmm. So if they sign up for the $5 a month thing, after two months, you get a free month. Ooh. So you then get refunded the previous month. That's pretty and cool. And we do that for everybody. Let I think, me pull up. I, I don't know. I just like the idea of everybody sort of, if you've helped me out, then I'll return the favor in whatever way I can. I like that. Um, so with the bot as well, like everyone, it is, you can customize it to certain bits. So with the games, you can have it as a transparent background. So over the top of us, if we wanted to, I've always been waiting the whole stream to do this. Chegel. We can put, yes, we can put Cheggle up. So Chegel. you can still see me and Andy with Cheggle over the top. Um, and I find like stuff like this is really good for if you're going to like be right back or if you're just like mm -hmm. sitting and just chatting, not doing much, it's pretty cool to have up. Um, well, that's what the mini games were originally created for. We, I used to see so many people streaming where they're like, oh, I need to go take a bathroom break, be right back. And they'd put up a be right back screen and yeah. it could be sat there for five minutes or so. And you could watch the numbers just start dropping down. Yeah. Where people are like, I, I don't want to sit here and stare at some text for a while. So if you put up a mini game, the races is quite popular for that, actually, because races it's are great visually engaging so they just sat there watching that and um yeah i noticed that viewer retention is actually it it, it can still drop but majority of the time it stays the same or you know very close to that number and i've even seen it um pull people in as they're browsing through looking at i don't know Fortnite, let's say and then they see <laughs> this random horse mini game they're like and they click in they're like what's what all this that? then and they start talking and joining yep. in because of that and people tend to get a free first try at a mini game i'm going to cover our faces for a second this is yep. the chalak website um so you do is have to click join now there's a bit of like explanation of what's included and stuff how often do you update the website um, not as often as I should. Because I know there's a command list as well. So if you guys ever do decide to get Chalak, which I recommend you do because I freaking love it. Um, it has all the commands. Whoa, there's heaps. You have added in so many more. Yeah, there's Extras. quite a few commands actually missing. Oh, yes. There's an awesome one with the clips on and the clips off and the mini screens on and the mini screens off. Mm. How do they work and what what made you think of those? Well, I, again, I that goes back, back to the on. time where Moth and I would be streaming on different channels. Because mm -hmm. I had the Andy 4D channel, he had D-Wing Moth channel. So what would happen is we'd be playing a multiplayer game, but we wanted to support one another. So I'd actually have his screen appear in like the bottom corner of my channel screen. Yep. And he'd have mine appear there, so we'd be promoting each other in that manner. Um, we also use the full screen mode where you can um, you could just type in exclamation mark screen and it would come up with a full screen of somebody, which was useful if you wanted to do a raid. Yeah. Um, and because we saw Ghost in the Machine, is it Ghost in yep. the Machine? That's correct. Yep. Because he had those screens in the background. Mm -hmm. We actually created the, uh, the setup so you can have four different mini screens showing up at the same time now. Yeah, which is pretty cool. He's also back on Twitch now, and he's back using I the bot again. Yeah. yeah, that's pretty cool. I reminded him. He's like, oh, yes, I missed the bot. So, yes, he's back. Um, and then you have uh, the clips. Um, clip on or clip off or the most it's recent. Clip, clip of, top clip. Don't do top clip, Chalak, please, I beg you. There's top <laughs> clip. There's um Is that you in a princess dress? Also... That is me in a princess dress. It <laughs> Do it. <laughs> no, Let's because it. everybody's there's this person who when we raid them, they have this whole spiel where they're like, Oh hey, hey, this is this person, they just raided me. Let's look at their top clip. That's his little thing. So every time we raid him, I have to sit there and watch me appear oh, as a no. princess. Um so Yeah. How did how did you become off, a princess? Let's let's tell everyone how you became a princess for a month we had a charity stream 
and we said we we started throwing out random things. We expected maybe to to um, raise about a hundred dollars. We didn't expect much at all. We were like hundred dollars, oh, that would be fun. So we put these really stupid goals in place, and yes, it was yes, seven hundred and fifty dollars. I would dress up like a princess for a month. Yep. <laughs> And it was if we got to a thousand dollars, Moth would dye his hair green, which he did. So, how much did you guys raise in the end? We got just over fifteen hundred dollars. Wow! And what was it um, going towards? What were you raising money for? That was um, mental health awareness. Yeah, fantastic. There's a charity in the UK called Mind. Great work. So, yeah, that's excellent. That, that was, was a that was like New Year's Eve, wasn't it? Just ask me, Z. So, something like that. Roughly. Round, round about that. But yeah, I uh, I now have to shave my legs. I was about to ask, like, have you shaved your legs yet? Because I, I keep getting asked by Matt. Legs. Matt's like, has he shaved his legs yet? I'm like, I keep getting to ask. Um, so the answer no. is no. Will you stream my, getting your legs was... shaved? I, I don't know if I'm allowed because I reckon oh. I will bleed. <laughs> and because I have no idea what I'm doing. Can't Rachel do it? My legs. Uh maybe get Rachel to shave I'm your not legs. sure I would trust her to do that though but she's your wife Andy of course yeah. you oh no she may have some issues she wants to take out on you <laughs> <laughs> I'm just I'm just afraid of like bleeding on stream that would be like an insta ban type thing so we might make a video there was also talk about moth coming to the UK uh in February which isn't obviously happening anymore oh yeah so if that was if that was happening um he was going to come over and we were going to shave each other's legs i suppose Ooh. <laughs> that's awesome so, but that's uh, yeah cool. that seems to be slightly out the window so we now need to figure out what we're going to do for that i know Dan yeah, COVID. That, was, that was another I'm one so of our sad. goals have you used the goal system i'd highly recommend you use the goal system what's the goal system I don't know if you about type it. in exclamation mark goal on, I believe. I don't know if it's one word or two words. I, like I said, I got so many commands. I keep forgetting my own stuff. Yeah. Exclamation mark goal on. Oh yeah, zero out of one thousand. Okay. Yeah. So when somebody donates to you, that goes up, and when it hits a thousand, it'll increase to two thousand, and. I don't know. I just find that when people have a visual thing saying, oh, look, they're so close to that. Yeah. They just seem to donate more when they have some sort of visual goal. And that was, we very quickly coded that and put that together uh, just before the uh, charity stream. How do I get it so, off? Uh, end? Goal X end? Make end? Goal no. off? <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have told you to do that. Hold on. Goal one second. end? <laughs> goal. That's okay, Spotlight. We'll just have a goal at the top that you guys can try and fulfill <laughs> somehow. Goal, goal space off. It's goal space off. Mine didn't work. Oh. Okay. Maybe I shouldn't have asked you to do that. Like I said, it, we we haven't used it since. So do just type in exclamation mark refresh now, and it will it will reload the stream. Sorry about that. Sorry, I didn't mean to break it. I haven't That's worked okay. on that for ages. We um, we put the code in, um, got very drunk, and then I haven't revisited it. So okay, it's gone. Is we it fixed, fixed it. now? Sorry it's all good. Oh, well, now it's connected to database. Thank you for being a gold supporter, Princess. See, gold supporter guys, you should also become a gold, gold supporter. supporter. Yep. Yeah. Um, it's very true though. Uh, with the cap dungeon, my stream loves it and will definitely pay for your year of Chalak. Definitely will, 100%. Actually, were I'm pretty you... sure mine paid within like the first time I used it. Yeah. yeah. You were like, okay, that's that's done now. It was, I, <laughs> I couldn't believe it. I posted like, it on the thing. Twitter, uh, the Chalak Twitter account. I was like, look at this. And it was just, you sat there and it just constantly, people coming in and leaving. It was, it was insane. Oh, yeah much you got from that with that um goal what contributes mm. to the goal is it just bits or is it just donations or what is it it's bits um and subs is 
the automated things, but you can also okay. add things. If somebody was to donate money, you know, through PayPal or something like that, you can physically add that in. So you How type you in uh, add donation, something like that, add donation. Sorry, it's a little bit hazy. Like I said, it, okay. I, I very quickly put it together yeah uh, just before the charity stream but it's something that we're going to be fleshing out and they, i think it's only in the beta version they literally made it and they got drunk so you can't blame andy for not remembering sorry yeah it was, it was a really good news sorry. eve stream you guys did though i thoroughly enjoyed yeah, it yeah i had a lot of fun with it it was a lot longer than i usually go for usually i'll stream for like two hours or so and then i'm like well, i think i'm done now yeah but that was but nope. that was quite a long one um i remember i was going to ask you you now have a phone app yes oh how, yes yeah how's how do we work the phone up how's it going how's it used what's why do we have it like tell us about the phone app um so originally we had a an actual twitch extension where it would appear on top of the screen yeah so it'd cover up the channel and people could play mini games through that and so cheggle for example they would literally move their mouse onto the screen aim it where they wanted to fire the ball and click yeah. And it was all very clever and stuff, but uh, I don't know, there were a few issues with Twitch. They wanted so many like precautions to be set up in a permanent um, server running in order to facilitate it. And I was oh, like, wow. that's a lot of that's a lot of work where I can literally create an app which you can play on your mobile phone. Yeah. And you can uh, I don't know, treat it as a multiplayer game essentially where the streamer is the host and everybody else is the peer mm -hmm. the, the like the the user the player yeah and that enabled us to create real-time mini games where because twitch naturally has a delay of anywhere between like three and 20 seconds and on mobile phones it could be a lot longer yeah if somebody just uses their mobile phone like you could pull up the bees mini game for example and then i could play it from here in the uk and it would be like two thousand miles away but because of the distance I, i'd wager there would be some sort of latency issue with the bee sort of like tap bouncing all over the place i can't tap the fly but. right now it's, it's really cool i quite like it um i haven't really told many people about your phone app yet how do we get it on our phones well it's still in uh it's app.chalak.com Okay, cool. And it's still in beta, is that what you're going to say? Massively. It was pre-alpha, probably. Pre-alpha, even. Yeah, really in development. You know that new game, the one where you're a little person and people in the chat can type in jump or run or... Mm -hmm. Will that also be on the phone? It will be, but we've actually changed that slightly because uh, people are complaining too much about the delay. Yeah so I totally understand I, yeah if you but if you try it out now it will probably break again <laughs> because that's also in development that's <laughs> that's not released to the silver people like that's still in beta but if you type in chaps now you'll see how how i've changed it oh stop left right down, so if you type down. in Ooh, okay exclamation mark right three Oh, that's cool. Which, then it pauses. Which, yeah. It pauses, which means that the enemy isn't just going to run straight into you anymore. Oh, and nice. You can get multiple people playing it. Yes. And uh, chat has more of a control over it as well. So more people can join in instead mm -hmm. of 10 people spamming right and left and jump. And yeah, I really like yeah. that actually. That's cool. But if you type in some of the commands will actually break it and so still in development as i said so yeah no nice that's also another game that is not ending for me right now <laughs> it's not ending i said it might break oh oh huh? what did you try typing in end oh, oh that's gone cool i i really like it i think it's come a long way um, I didn't see when you first made, but I did see it at very early. Well, I like to think I saw it very early. Um, so where I've known it from to where it's come now, it's come such a long way. It's come really far. Yeah. I, I like during its development, I've always wanted to have this, what's the word? 
ethos? What's the ethos? Uh, guiding principle, I suppose, would be I want to make the bot that people want. So I mm -hmm. really encourage people to actually, if they have something that they want, like an idea, they'll contact me and if it's possible, I will do it. Yeah. That's why it's so all over the place and so like random, all the different features which you can have. That um, was one of my main things. So I remember you kept asking me going, come use it, come use it. I'm like, I don't want to use it. And we had that big conversation. It's like, why don't I want to use it? And I'm like, because it doesn't have this and it doesn't have this. And because I use this a lot. Um, and you added stuff in. So like the shout out command, which is used all the time. You put that in. I can't remember what you put in anymore. But there's a few things that I wanted in the bot and you did it. And now your bot is pretty much the only bot that I use apart from stream elements, which does nothing except commands in my chat. So yeah. Which is useful. Which is useful, yes, but Chalak is interactive and fun, which is also very useful. <laughs> so yeah, that's that's. I I just want to make a bot which everybody sort of wants. If there's a bot, they're like, oh no, I use this bot for that. I'm like, well, if I can add that feature into this, you can use that. Even if it's included in the free version, I just want. Yeah. My stream does miss um, adventures though. People still they come miss in. The adventures. Yeah. Because when I use Phantom Bot, we had the adventure, and they'll type in adventure, and people could join in. Um, and then once the adventure closes, it would be like, oh no, we're going on a bear hunt, and Red Hat fell over and lost his leg, but made it back to safety. Like, I don't know, it was stupid. Yeah, yeah, like no, I remember that. I, yeah. I did that on yours. They loved it, and they miss it. Yeah. Yeah, I on actually... the odd occasion. One of the mini games I really wanted to make for Chalak was a visual version of that. Oh yeah. So, because I, I I want to reach a point where, uh, people will dedicate the stream to the Chalak mini games if that makes sense. Yeah. So, similar to some people actually play the Stream Raiders, they'll just they'll have the game title set to Stream Raiders, and that's all they'll do. Um. You want so to see it was going to be a little RPG game where they would um. It would come up with a visual dungeon or something and people would move around and they'd get into a fight so a, a final fantasy type turn-based yep. fight system mm -hmm. so it'd have their characters there and it would have a boss character which they have to fight and they can earn caps and stuff like that and That'd be um, awesome. but it was going to be the sense that they their character is actually saved into a database so then if they moved from your stream to my stream my, your channel to my channel their character would retain their experience and their abilities and their name and everything like that and they could then fight yeah, right. my character my dungeon yeah. so those little missions which you were talking about i wanted that but in a visual format That'd be pretty cool. That would take a while to build, though, wouldn't it? That would... Uh, it would probably take about a month or so to build. Yeah. Oh. You have I a lot of ideas coming up, don't you? you yeah. I, I, there's one of the mini games which I've started to make was a little pool game, like a snooker or that type of thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And the idea was it will put down all your icons would be the balls, and you have to knock everybody's icons using your icon you hit your icon into their icon and you try to pop their icons yeah into the corner pocket That'd be and cool. it's whoever's the last person standing i love all the games you come up with you have some like really good ideas yeah it's just finding the time to make them all if you need an artist have you seen me do some drawings on stream lately i have <laughs> they are pretty superb you let me know when you're free and get things going. <laughs> they're pretty shocking, but they've been so much fun. Yep. Mm. They're pretty cool. They're actually on a mug now, a few of them. Yep. Oh, cool. Yeah, some of the Pokemon I ones need, are on a mug. I need mugs and stuff <laughs> sorted out. Actually, you and Moth are looking at getting some merch or something? Yeah, Moth actually put the the like site live. Oh. When it wasn't ready. Oh. And somebody snuck in and quickly bought something and we we're like, it's, oh, it's not ready. Oh. So Will that have the Chalak symbol on it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. That'd be cool. Um let me know when it's ready, because I'd love to buy some merch. Some Ooh, I think merch. we owe you some, don't you? Didn't you, didn't do. you win? I did. Yeah. 
But I still want merch. I like merch. What can I say? <laughs> Gotta support you guys. Yeah. Um, About a year ago, Moth made some little pins, little Chalak triangle pins, which you put on your oh, yeah. t-shirt. That's pretty and cool. And we, we haven't given out a single one to oh. anybody. Are they still sitting at Moth's house? Ago. Yeah. She's got these big pile he of pins. holds them up every now and then. Oh my gosh. Go go steal pins He's from got like him. 500 of them, something like that. Why does he send them out? I don't know. I don't know. That I would get he, really he, annoying. No, That's like 500 to. pins just sitting there would do my head in. <laughs> I'm like, you guys need to go. Just, <laughs> you need just to get like off my the, desk. Just like the postcards. Um, yes. My camera just went all blurry. Hey, camera, can you fix it? Why have you, you gone all... Oh, there you go. I'm, I'm right now. Yeah, the postcards really annoy me as well. I just see this pile sitting there. I'm like, can people just, like, buy them, please? Didn't you have stickers or something at some point? Remember um, like... No, I didn't have... St well, I got stickers for when I went to a PAX event, and I had a few left over. So I was I giving see. stickers away on stream that I hadn't given away at the PAX event. That's about it. But yeah. Well, Andy, is there anything else that we haven't covered in Chalak? Probably. There probably is, isn't there? <laughs> probably. It's fine though. There's there's too much and it's always there's it's always lot. growing. I'm always working on it. I'm just looking so at it's the It's been a long project. What's the wheel? What? You don't you don't ever do the wheel? No, I never do the wheel. Oh, that has a caps on it. Yes, I know that one. I the never use it. I always the... forget about it. Oh, that's really popular. I always it's, lose my caps when I do your stream. Doom now. Yeah. yeah, yeah. People call it the wheel of doom. They hate it, but they it's very addictive. Bloody wheel. Oh my gosh. Excellent. Well, I will find Andy's video on how to join sign up mm. make it work and i will put that down below as well all of andy's mm. stuff is going to be down below his his uh twitch account his patreon the chuggle cheggle no chalak get it right Chuggle, you love Chuggle. <laughs> i love cheggle it's always on my mind <laughs> <laughs> um, the chalak website and his uh video will all be down below um so you guys can find that and if you have any questions feel free to ask me and i'll pass it on to andy because i probably can't answer your questions <laughs> But, yeah. Well, Andy, this was better than you thought it was going to be, wasn't it? It was much easier than I thought it was going to be. See, it's not that, not that hard. You're Just... a good host. A oh, good host. yay. Pat on the back to me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, I'm going to let you go do your stuff now, and I'm going to go do my stuff. And thank Woo. you for having a chat. It's been, a, been a delightful to talk about it yeah <laughs> all righty um yeah guys look down below find andy go see him tomorrow on his uh oh actually i can say that this comes out in two fridays so yeah go see him tomorrow after you've watched that on uh twitch.tv forward slash uh chalak yep yeah and go spam him with like all the celebrations mass celebrations all sarcastic celebrations yeah <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, bye, Royal Spotlight, and see you, Andy. Thank you for the chat. <laughs> bye. Bye. <laughs>